It's something to note about the time shirt kit and don't know if it's the same with other kits but you can see with this time shirt kit for this Triton engine don't know if you can see this right here but this seat cutter has a little sloped piece right there above these cutters right here and that piece this little slope piece right here it's designed to cut down into the head and ride on the eventually cut down in and eventually ride exactly on the tapered spark plug seat that was cut there by the factory so if your head has already had a, uh, a bigger reamer go down through there or you've been drilled out with a helicoil or something like that, if that factory spark plug seat, tapered seat, is gone, it's going to be a problem with this tool because this tool expects to eventually just cut, 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 cut until you hit that factory spark plug seat and it stops right here as it rubs and then it stops cutting the seat. Without that there, if the... Uh, spark plug hole had been bored out before for a previous insert this will just keep cutting and cutting and cutting because it'll never hit this piece right here now they have some documentation online time cert does it says well you can run this down in there you can measure it you can decide how far it should go you can put a mark on the tool and that probably would work or if you had the heads off of course it probably wouldn't be a problem because you just watch it from the inside you know cut through till you had a, a reasonable seat and then call it done you know, if you're going to do this in place over the fender you need to kind of measure how deep everything is, how deep it is to the inside of the, you know, maybe with a bent uh, coat hanger, reach in there and find out where the inside of the, the spark plug hole is inside the cylinder, find out how deep everything is, put this in your wrench, you know, find out how deep this combination is, find out how deep you ought to go, put a mark on here with some blue tape, and then you could probably cut it in that way, so you just, because you just need to cut enough seat for the insert, the flange on the top of the insert to set into, so I think with you know, proper care, you could do an over the fender fix for one that had been previously helicoiled. But, like I said, if you if you don't have the spark plug seat in there, the factory one, you can't just jam this down in there and expect it to cut until it stops. If you do have the factory seats, which I do, I checked them with a, a bore scope, you know, when I pulled them out and looked at them, you just run this down in there and it'll just keep cutting the seat until it hits up against there and it'll just stop cutting and just start spinning freely as it just rides on the existing spark plug seat. So, just something to keep in mind if you're doing a, a, a recoil, you know, doing it again.